things. I was inspired to start my podcast because when I started talking about real things essentially on my Instagram, people were really responsive to it. I found that I could only express so much in a paragraph. I was over the fact that I had to post something about how I looked. The podcast was a perfect medium because I could talk about things in depth and I wanted to be able to like highlight other people's stories and experiences. Not only do I just love talking to women that inspire me and that are cool and have something to say, um, I also wanted to be able to share that with other people. So. I've been given a lot of advice from my mom. She said, is no one's gonna care more about your career than you. And that was kind of mind blowing. It's true, you know, and like it's up to me to go out into the world and like create something for myself. What advice would I give my 16 year old self? Oh. I would say I see you. Yeah, I would say that. I believe you. That's totally what I would say. Putting this idea out into the world that like everything's all good. And I just was like, I just don't want to do that anymore. Like, I don't want to mislead people in this world of just like being so fake online. And I was just bored of it. Because people listen to me for whatever reason, I feel like it's my duty and obligation, honestly, to use that in a positive way. Because I have a little sister who's 12, I started thinking like, what would I want her, what world do I want her to grow up in? I don't want her to grow up in a world where she feels like she has to look a certain way in order to be beautiful. I wanted to start spreading awareness about mental health because it's something that I've struggled with my entire life. We live in this world of everyone putting on a face that it's all good all the time and my life, I'm traveling all these places and like my relationship's perfect and like I don't have one single pimple, you know? Like that looks so great and that's so not my reality and I realized that I didn't want to be participating in that anymore. I just felt like I wanted to be honest about what was going on. A lot of other people dealt with mental health and I don't know, I just felt like, again, I just felt like it was an obligation. Like, I'm given this platform, I have to do something good with it. If I could help a few people feel less alone, especially in this world of like isolation and also feeling like you have to be perfect all the time, then it was worth it.